In this video, I'm going to show you how to find a seed on any Minecraft server. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go to the link in the description down below and in the pinned comment, and it is going to bring you to this GitHub page over here where you're able to go ahead and access the seed cracker mod, which we're going to be using in order to do this process. So please go ahead and scroll down and then where it says version tab, make sure you select it for the right version of Minecraft. So for this video, I'm going to be working with the most recent version, which at the time recording this video is 1.21.10. Now you just want to go ahead and select on seed cracker version right over here so go ahead and install it and then there you go please drag and drop it to your desktop because it's significantly easier to do it that way and also in order to run this mod you will need to have fabric installed so please make sure to download fabric if you haven't already because we're going to be using that in order to actually run this mod so if you haven't downloaded fabric just go ahead and look up fabricmc.net then go ahead and press on download then go ahead and press on download universal jar and you are good to go okay once you have both fabric installed and seed cracker installed go ahead and open up the minecraft launcher like you normally would once you're in the minecraft launcher make sure that java edition is selected then go to the top menu and press on installations over here where it says versions please make sure that modded is turned on and then in this list you should be able to see fabric loader right over here and then the version of minecraft you installed it for so again we are working with 1.21.10 and yep we have fabric right over here so the next thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and select on this open installations folder option just like so then you're going to get a bunch of folders that look like this from here please go ahead and scroll down until you see a folder called mods in all lowercase and open it up from here, go ahead and drag and drop the Seed Cracker X mod inside of your mods folder just like this. Then once you're done with that, go ahead and close out the mods folder, open up the Minecraft launcher, then make sure to select on Fabric, and then go ahead and press on Play. From here, wait for Minecraft to load in. All right, once you have that done, go ahead and load into your server. All right, and once you're in your Minecraft world, open up the chat, then look up Seed Cracker. Then go ahead and press GUI just like so. And you want to make sure you have the exact settings like this. So you just want to go ahead and scroll down and where it says render outlines, make sure that X-ray is selected. Then scroll down over here, make sure that Emerald Ores is turned off. Same thing with Desert Welt, Warp Fungus, Biomes, and End Gateways. All right, so once you have these settings just like this, you are good to go. So in order to get started, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and type in this command. Seed Cracker. Then go ahead and look up Cracker one more time then on just like so and then there you go it will now say already enabled so now what we need to do is we need to go ahead and find five distinct structures in our minecraft world and based on those five structures it is actually going to determine the world seed for you so you can obviously do this process in survival mode but i'm going to be doing it in creative mode just so the process can be a little bit more clear but you could also do this in survival mode in the server of your choosing so look at this this right over here is a structure you're able to notice because it does have this outline over here and and what you want to do is you want to go inside of the structure and just roam and round inside of the structure for a little bit go ahead and explore it uh get all the loot and stuff like that so yeah we got one structure down right over here and now let's go ahead and find another structure so yeah so this right over here is our second structure so literally just go inside of it roam around and now you just want to repeat the same thing for five structures in total so i'll be right back with you guys once i went ahead and went to five different structures but if you guys have been finding this video helpful so far, consider checking out our partners over at Simple Game Hosting. Simple Game Hosting offers affordable and high quality Minecraft server hosting where you're easily able to set up a 24 seven unlimited slot server for you and all of your friends. And what's great about Simple Game Hosting is that you're easily able to find your world seed. You don't need to do any of this complicating mod stuff or anything like that because when you have your own server, you get to control everything. You can make your server Java only, Bedrock only, include mods, mod packs, and plugins all with the click of a single button. At the moment, they're currently Doing a sale where everybody who gets a Minecraft server gets 25% off their very first month of server hosting. So if that is something you're interested in, feel free to check out the link in the description down below and in the pinned comment. All right, guys, so I just went ahead and got five structures, and then the chat is going to say started lifting with five structures. This may take a few minutes, so there you go. It is now actually going to begin the process of finding your seed. All right, and eventually we were able to go ahead and find our seed right over here. So if you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial.